Hey, Ben Wise is Zor Fitness, and today I want to talk about the worm bar facing burpee. So I'll show you, and then I'll talk about it a little bit more. So the worm and bar facing burpee is a great sustainable option for a lot of athletes. In other words, even when you're breathing jacked up, even when you're course fatigued, even when your triceps are tired, you're able to continue to move through the movement and not basically stop and rest, right? The idea is that you can continue to actually accumulate reps even though you're tired, right? So it's a great sustainable option for people to pull out of their back pocket, so to speak, and like insert this particular variation of bar facing burpee when you're tired and fatigued. All right, so three points of performance that are gonna help you out while you're actually doing this. So first of all is snap. So in other words, you're going to swoop the feet, come back, and then you're gonna come up into this kneeling plank position, and then you're gonna snap, get your hips up towards the ceiling, and think about bringing those feet up underneath your body as close as you can, right? So the big goal is to bring those feet underneath so that you aren't way far away from the bar and then have to walk up to the bar before you take a step. The goal is for, again, number one is to snap. Two is to hop. So the goal is for my feet to be close enough where I can do a pathetic little jump where I don't really pull my knees up to my chest this way. Rather, I just kind of do one of those and get over the bar. Right, so it's a two foot takeoff, a two foot landing. I'm facing the same direction. So then lastly, I spin. And then I basically flop down to the floor and do it again. Snap, hop, spin. Snap, hop, spin. So there you have it, that is the worm bar facing burpee. 